What's going on guys and welcome to a brand new Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach Breakdown video. Yes, you guys heard those words correctly. We are going to be watching, reacting, and breaking down the brand new just released Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach trailer. This was just shown on the PlayStation 5 press conference and I haven't seen it. I'm super excited to be breaking it down with you guys and watching it, reacting to it. But boy, am I excited. I, I couldn't even wait to like do this reaction video. I just wanted to watch it right away, but I haven't. So let's go ahead and press play and just watch it. Oh, I'm so excited. You guys know we're gonna break all this down and see what's gonna have in store. Gregory, <gasps> your friends are worried about you. Oh my, I can they see the face on the, me. on the forklift. Please come out. <laughs> Gregory, oh I may have lost my temper earlier, but it was just a glitch. Oh, who's that? It won't happen again. Is that Ballora? What the heck? No, what was that thing? It's been such a difficult day for all of us. No, you can't just- Why don't you come out and we can play a game together? Oh my god. The mall. The mall. It looks insane! It won't happen again. <laughs> I'm so excited. I'm so unbelievably excited. Oh my- It was just a glitch. Gregory. Oh! Still. Oh my god! I think she's found her. Holy crap. I can't. I can't. <laughs> oh my gosh! No! Is that it? That, yep, that, that is after, oh, oh my gosh, dude. I'm so excited. I am so freaking excited. This trailer, waiting for it all day today, had my anxiety through the roof. And to finally be watching it with you guys, oh, this is, okay, we gotta break it down. Though We gotta start from the beginning because obviously it looks like we're in the pizzeria, right? But we're in like the back part of it. So this is obviously like where the, one of the emergency exits is. So this is not the front of the pizzeria where everything's all gold and glamorous and nice. No, this is the back part where there's a giant tub of who knows what with a Fazbear logo on it and some creepy red lighting and what appears to be probably a door that shuts right here. Now, check this out. The first thing, I knew this was gonna be crazy because look at this. You can already see the new animatronic right there on the little forklift and another little icon right there, which I'm not sure what that is, but I don't know. If you guys have any guesses, let me know in the comment section down below. And of course, if you guys know anything that I miss out on, let me know in those comment section down below right now. Like, let me know anything, all right? Because I want to know everything that we miss out on this on this trailer. So it looks like over here we have some fragile boxes with world on them, which that's interesting because why does it say world? I Your wonder. friends are worried about you. Hmm. And of course, we have this lady in the background, which is probably Vanny, and she's talking to a child. Now, this child is obviously in panic, it's in fear, it's hiding, and we know at the end, the child does get found by Vanny, and it's actually being helped, apparently, by someone else. We heard a male voice right there, but yeah, she's kind of- They're here with me. She's trying to get this child to follow her, and take a look right here on the right side, okay? Yeah, you know who that is, right? The giant sharp ears, or at least who they want us to believe this is. This appears to be Vanny right here. Now, she's coming through the emergency exit, it seems like, or some kind of emergency door right here. And I'm assuming this is probably where these machines right here go through. And uh, she's just, you know, casually walking through. Now, take a look at these boxes right here. It looks like we have possibly Buff Helpy. Not Buff Helpy, but just normal Helpy. I mean, imagine... <laughs> Imagine Buff Helpy on the side of that box. That'd be incredible. But no, probably just normal old Helpy, Helpy in the game. But uh, I, I think that's who that is on that please box. It's kind of blurry, out. but... So she's telling this child, please come out. Gregory, Wait, does she say his name, actually? Hold on, go back. I may Gregory. Gregory. Okay, so the child's name is Gregory. Now, we go from that area in there where obviously boxes are being, you know, stored and things are going down. And then obviously beyond that room, scary things are going down. Now we're in what appears to be a kitchen of some sort. I may have lost my temper earlier. So this is definitely a kitchen. Now, right off the bat, this thing looks, this is the world's creepiest kitchen, all right? Come on, what kind of kitchen looks like this, dude? Obviously, you've got some kind of machine over here to the right. It's a huge machine, too. I'm not sure what this thing is, but I'm assuming it's probably going to be important. Now, on the left side right here, you have all the, you know, the pots and the pans and stuff like that. You know, typical stuff, but you, you guys see that creepy little hand up there, right? Let, let's it keep playing the trailer. So, we're being watched throughout this trailer by whatever that is. And that honestly looks like Ballora to me, but I, I don't know what else this thing could be. <laughs> I mean, it could just be some entirely new animatronic. Maybe this is that male voice that we heard talking, but I thought that was that new version of Freddy, maybe? I have no idea, but place your best guess right, guess, guesses right now in the comment section down below. What do you guys think this is? Ennard, Ballora, I, I, if you somehow think this is Phantom BB, I don't care, okay? Just let me know your guesses, because I want to know what you guys think, and if any of them make any sense, then we'll go from there, but let's continue. Look at this thing. It just, it's watching us. It looks like a roller coaster. It's just like watching us, and it just, just goes away into the background. Now, can we see that machine any closer? No, what is this? It almost looks like an elevator or something. What do you guys think about that? I'm guessing maybe an elevator or, but then again, why would there be an elevator in a kitchen? And where would this thing even lead to? I have no idea. 
Now, this is where things get very exciting because, and also very interesting because they, the doors close and you can tell these are like pizzeria doors or a mall, you know, a set of mall doors or something like that. But then it fades to black. And instead of just going straight from that door to the new location, it starts us off right on top of the new location, you know, up in this area right here. And that, that kind of leads me to believe that that might be like a separate location or... That could just be, you know, just a transition. It could just be a simple transition, or this could be some other location on the location or something like that. I don't know. Anyways, we're going to continue. and Let's see what else there is here. So this little office right here definitely surprised me because when I first saw it at the start of the video, I thought this looked like the sister location office. So I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> is this somehow the sister location, you know, little office that you go through? If you guys remember to get to baby's room and entered and, and Funtime Freddy, that little middle office, that's what I thought this was. But no, this is such a difficult day for all of us. As you can see. It's been a very difficult day for all of them there. She's still hunting this child. But yeah, this is apparently some kind of like upstairs sitting room or something. Now, you can also see the new character right there. It's a gator. And uh, obviously, that's a new gator animatronic. Now, he does look like he has some kind of a laser tag area down there. Oh, that's going to be so cool. So my guess is these are like walls. And this is like an entire laser tag like playground maybe. I don't know. And then, of course, there's a staircase that leads all the way up there. The thing I love about this so far is it really leaves a lot to be like, it, it leaves a lot to mystery. This place looks massive, and it looks like there's a lot of different areas where a lot of bad stuff can go down. Now, we also have the new um, Freddy animatronic right there on the right side, and uh, it looks like he's standing in his own area. Now, if we continue, this looks like a bridge maybe that crosses into this same other, you know, this little laser tag area or something like that. Hmm. Wait a minute. Okay, so that's the last we see of this area right here. So there's another area back there. It looks like another possible ride or something like that. It looks like some kind of globe with like a ring around it. And then over here, there's another thing. It almost looks like a pigtail or something, but I'm not sure. So that could be a whole other character. Now we back up, and I'm going to go ahead and just... So we continue to back up, and you get a better look at, I guess, before you go inside the actual mall, maybe? Because my guess is this is where you enter. They check your tickets. Obviously, there's these little concession stand thing, whatever you want to call it right here. You take the stairs up, and then you're into that main area where we just saw the laser tag and whatever else is in there. It looks like there's probably going to be, like, maybe three or four different big zones in there, and each zone is going to have, like, its own animatronic to maybe correspond with it. I don't know, but that's that looks so exciting, though, regardless. Now, this area right here, you've got a gigantic... What appears to be, that's not Freddy Fazbear because you can look at the shoulders. That's that new version of Freddy. And then on the right side, you can obviously see there's like a little cutout of him right here on this side. Along with that new Chica character. And what appears to be some kind of location over here. Now, I don't know what this says. It looks like it almost says Glamour... Glamour girl or I don't know glamour something so this might have to do with the new version of Chica This could be her area or maybe some kind of a gift shop or something like that that has to do with her now on the left side You guys can see this looks like I have no idea This almost looks like an office or something and there's obviously this is weird too There's a door down here, but it's blocked off and it that's I think that's typically what you use if there's like an elevator so on this left side, that, that's probably what that is. Maybe there's an elevator there that takes us to the, that second area or it takes you further down. I don't know. Now let's go ahead and continue watching. So this child is still in panic. Now wait, we have to pause right here because there is our first look at the logo. Freddy Fazbear's Pizza Plex, if I had to take a guess. I mean, obviously, I hope. <laughs> And there's the new characters right there. Now, this is the, if obviously if you piece these two things together, you get the full image. But yeah, that looks cool though. I love that logo. Let's continue. Gregory. Now, this character right here. Hold on, hold on. What does she say before this guy starts talking? Hold on, let's go back a little bit here. Gregory. So she's just hunting for the child. The child's... It was just a glitch. It was just a glitch. Oh, she's got some pieces of glitch trap coming out. She's got she's got some little pieces of glitch trap coming out of her. You might want to keep those inside. Well, I guess not at this point. She's already got this child like in a back room. So she's glitching out, and then this guy says something. Gregory, be still. I think she's found us. So this guy seems to be helping us. And it's weird here. He says us. So we're maybe helping. The animatronic says, my guess is this is that Freddy animatronic. It, I don't know for sure, but this is just my guess. And maybe we're trying to help him and he's trying to help us. So we're trying to like, we're doing like a beneficial thing here. We're helping each other. And he's telling this child to stay still and stay quiet. And unfortunately, well, you guys know what happens next. Okay, so we get jump scared by Vanny. Now, if we go back though, it almost looks like we get a little bit of a sneak peek. Ooh, wait a minute. I think... 
Okay, no, we don't get much. No, it's it's covered on purpose. You can see there's lights right here on the left side, lights in the middle. This is probably like an arcade or something, just judging by the lighting. But no, because look, everything changes. The lighting around us, the lighting everywhere. They really wanted to keep that like a secret wherever she was. But man, I am wondering who this child is, where he's hiding, why he's hiding, and uh, how Vanny's going to play out here and why she's glitching out and how that's going to work. Because I'm so excited. I hope we get to see her just randomly glitching out and stuff like that. It'd be crazy. I really want to see if I can pause it, though, right when it happens. Because it looks like... No, yeah, you don't get a look. They have some kind of, like, weird thing blocking everything. Like, see, it, like, blurs out the whole sides of it for some reason. They probably did that on purpose, but still... Guys, that was the FNAF Security Breach trailer. We did a reaction. We did a breakdown. And overall, I am so excited. We're going to do one more quick look through just to make sure we didn't miss anything. So first of all, we got this creepy area back there with the big old tubs of who knows what in there. Okay, there's something in there. Probably bodies. Who knows? Scary. We also have another exit door right there and another door over here, it looks like. And this is definitely, I don't know if this is part of the pizza plex. I mean, it seems like it probably is. I don't know why it wouldn't be. But it's just that that transition was weird to me. Either that or to get here. Is going to be something crazy because they wouldn't just start that transition from the top like that I feel like they would have just continued it from the back into the front of the pizzeria But since they started from the top I think this is probably underneath the pizza plex and maybe I've taken elevator I don't know but then again, why would there be exit doors like this? No, see it can't it can't work It can't work So if we continue though, I'm going to mute her though if we continue um, Of course we get a look at the kitchen that other box stacking area We get a crazy animatronic right here, which is really cool to see and then if we continue forward, um, we got like an elevator or something right there. We really don't know what that is. And also the pizza doors right here also lead me to believe that that's probably not underground or something like that. I don't think they would go through all the work to put doors like that there. Now, of course, we got this upper office with some kind of maybe a jukebox right there. Um, the gator, the other version of Freddy, and some kind of maybe a laser tag area. I only say that because of what he's holding in his hands right here and what Freddy's holding too. This just looks like a laser tag arena. I've been to a few of them and that's what it looks like in real life. Well, not exactly like this, but you know what I mean. It looks similar to this. Now we continue. We get our first look at the entrance and some kind of area up there. See, there is a second floor for sure, like above this. So this already goes up a, like a two-story height. But then it looks like there's almost like a third floor because, yeah, wait, that's an elevator maybe? I don't know because that definitely looks like it goes up. But I don't, I mean, yeah, let me know, guys. Do you think this is possibly an elevator to go to another floor? And also, these little gift shops and areas like this really intrigue me, too, because I'm, I'm wanting to know what else is to the right and to the left. There's just so much here. And also, to the right and to the left here, you can tell there's more. So this is probably where you buy your tickets to the left and to the right, and then you walk in through here. And this place definitely gets packed, because look at how big of an area this is. This place is huge, okay? This is not no Chuck E. Cheese pizzeria today, all right? This is Chuck E. Cheese back in 2008 or something when it was blowing up all right <laughs> like this is craziness and of course it just ends with the vanny jump scare so guys that's where i'm gonna end this video of course if you guys are looking for more fnaf security breach videos like this one demolish that subscribe button and the little bell icon right now because trust me there's gonna be so many videos on this game that you're not gonna want to miss a single one and i'm thinking about doing a five things you missed in the trailer because i think there's still more that we haven't even found yet that people are gonna be finding throughout the days and stuff like that and i don't know let me know if you guys want to see that if you guys do just destroy that like button down below right now and of course hit that subscribe button and guys i will see you guys in the next fnaf security breach video peace out